Hello, I'm Jovan Johnson. The Broadcasting Commission of Jamaica has imposed an immediate ban on the playing of music that promotes or glorifies lottery scamming, the use of the illicit drug Molly, and illegal guns. The Commission says the directive to radio stations reinforces its commitment to keeping airwaves free of harmful content. 28-year-old taxi operator Travarda Patterson was shot and killed along Dulwich Drive in Grand Spen St. Andrew on Tuesday morning. According to eyewitnesses, Mr. Patterson was arguing with another man when he was shot. St. James businessman Chad Headley, who pleaded guilty last month to unlawfully possessing several exotic birds at his home, was slapped with a fine of $50,000 on Tuesday. He faces 30 days in prison if he does not pay the fine. Mr. Headley and his wife, Sheena, are also battling drug charges after 25 pounds of cocaine was seized in June, the same time the birds were found. The coronation of Jamaica's head of state, King Charles III, is to be held on May 6 at Westminster Abbey in London. Charles ascended the British throne when his mother, Queen Elizabeth II, died last month. In sports, Argentina has another injury concern ahead of FIFA's Football World Cup in November after Angel Di Maria exited a UEFA Champions League game on Tuesday. Di Maria was running for a ball in the first half when he pulled up grasping the back of his right thigh and wincing in pain. In your currency trading at midday today, one US dollar was being sold for $153.50, the British pound sterling for $174.65, and the Canadian dollar for $113.13. In your weather forecast, Wednesday morning will be partly cloudy. In the afternoon, expect isolated showers and thunderstorms, mainly across central and western parishes. And that's it for the Gleaner Minute. Remember to follow us on Twitter, Facebook and Instagram and like, comment and share on YouTube. I'm Jovan Johnson.